How's it going guys? Today, I'm going to talk about the guy who scored the final Emmy basket of the 90s, named Jumaine Jones. Well, let's just dive right into it. Jumaine Jones was born on February 10th of 1979 in Cocoa, Florida. He will grow up there until his freshman year of high school, when his family will move to Camilla, Georgia. Once there, he would attend Mitchell Baker High School and would play for the basketball team. By his senior year, he would be a star player on the team, averaging 33 points and 13.5 rebounds per game. After high school, he'd attend the University of Georgia, where as a freshman, he'd lead the Bulldogs basketball team in scoring and rebounding. In his sophomore season with the team, he'd become the first sophomore in the school's history since Dominique Wilkins to score 1,000 points. After Jermaine's sophomore season with the Bulldogs was over, he'd declare himself for the NBA draft. He'd get selected by the Atlanta Hawks as a 27th overall pick, but would then get traded to Philadelphia. In his rookie season with Philadelphia, he would barely get to play, but one of the times he did get to be on the hardwood, he would make NBA history. On December 30th of 1999, in a game against the Portland Trailblazers, with just three seconds left in the game, Jermaine Jones would make a three-point shot to give the Sixers a 108-90 lead. This shot by Jermaine would not only be the last bucket of the game, but also the last NBA bucket of the 20th century. He should be put in the Hall of Fame just for that alone. <laughs> okay, anyways. After Jermaine's rookie season, he would play one more season in Philadelphia, making it to the NBA Finals with the team. In the finals against the Lakers, he'd average two points and two assists while playing 12.3 minutes per game. Yeah, pretty bad. After his 2001 season with the Sixers, he'd go on to be an NBA journeyman, playing with teams like Cleveland, Boston, LA, Charlotte, and Phoenix. After the 07 season, Jumaine would go on to play with several professional basketball teams overseas. And in 2016, he retired from professional basketball. Now, before I end this video, I want to share with you guys a fun Jermaine Jones fact. His nickname is Thrilla from Camilla. Camilla being the place where Jermaine Jones would grow up and would be a standout basketball player. Well, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Basket maker out. Peace! And, uh... He got that money from the Boston Celtics. Ooh, yes. He threw it in the hole! Jermaine Jones! How sensational was that? From about 59 feet.